Hey guys, uh, my name is Eric Stolp. Uh, I've never actually done an unboxing video, uh, but I actually just got probably the best double box day I probably ever had. Um, I would be safe to say that I have officially um, acquired one of my grails. Uh, I have been searching for this figure for quite a while. Um, I would say at least three years now since uh, I've seen it in the groups and stuff like that. Um, you know, I really admired this this figure in particular, um, and I am super, super excited that I finally, finally found one um, on Yahoo Japan uh, about a week ago. Um, but I also got some other very, very awesome figures that I actually wanted to show everybody. Um, so without further ado, uh, let's get right into it. Now this figure, I've only seen one person actually ever have it. Uh, so if you do have it, you know, please share it. But uh, this thing is amazing. Wow. This is the green glow-in-the-dark King Ghidorah Gigabrain. Uh, like I said, I've only seen one other person have this. I've never seen this for sale, ever. Uh, this happened just to pop up on Yahoo Japan recently, and I can't believe I snagged it for the price I got it for. I am super excited for this figure. I mean, this thing is amazing. I won't take it out yet, but I will post pictures uh, after the video of what it looks like. Uh, up close in detail, uh, but this thing is, this thing is awesome. Wow. Yeah, this is a very limited run of these, of these glowies, so me, uh, able to snag this one is seriously awesome. Alright, that was my first one. This is the newly released Marusan Rose Bailante. This is a lottery figure that, uh, unfortunately, I wasn't able to enter the lottery, but I did snag one on Yahoo Japan, and this thing is huge. Wow. Like, this thing is ginormous. <laughs> Yeah, I'll definitely be uh, trying to get the uh, the glow in the dark and the painted ones, but uh, I was happy with grabbing this one. Wow. Yeah, this thing is freaking massive. That is number two. One 
one box now. This is another one I've been looking for for a while. Oh, nice. This is the Marmont Godzilla, Red Godzilla Tower, actually. You see that there? Awesome. Definitely happy to get this in the collection, finally. I know there's three different colors, um, blue, yellow, and red, and I thought there was, one of them was harder to find than the other, and I don't remember which one it is. Um, so please, if anybody knows which one's actually the hardest one to grab, uh, just let me know. We got super stoked. This is the Final Wars Manda by Marmot, actually. Kind of see him a little bit there. I saw this a couple years ago at G-Fest, and I wanted to get it, but for the price they wanted, I wasn't going to pull the trigger. Um, but this is another one I found on Yahoo Japan recently for a very, very good price, and I, I couldn't pass it up. So... Plus, this is uh, uh, actually my first Manda in my collection, actually. Uh, so I'm actually pretty stoked uh, about having this one in my collection. Um, I know everybody hates on Final Wars a lot, you know, but I actually like the, the redesign for Manda in that movie. Uh, yeah, he didn't get a lot of screen time, and yeah, he died right away, but, you know, he's still a pretty cool uh, kaiju. So, yeah. Last but not least, like I said, guys, this is the one that I've been, oh my gosh, waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting patiently on, and I couldn't believe I got it. I, you know, it's, it's a rather pricey figure but I just kind of I just had to pull the trigger because you don't see them around much especially for sale and this one is actually decently priced for how much these things go for um, so I am super excited for this one um, like I said I've seen these go you know in other people's collections and stuff like that and once I saw them I knew I had to have them and I know there's there's three um, variants of this guy, uh, but there was just one particular one I really really wanted. Obviously, I want to get them all, um, but this colorway is the one I really really wanted. And actually, uh, a certain collector just posted you know pictured about this actual figure. You know, shout out to Christine. But. I have chills actually right now. <laughs> like, legit chills. I have the Toy Graph Diver Set. 
Holy shit. Like, this... My hair is literally sticking up on the back of my head right now. Like, seriously, I have chills that I actually have this in my hands. Wow. This is, like I said, a grail that I've been searching for for at least three years. At least. And finally having it is... I'm speechless. I'm, I'm beyond words right now. Like, this thing is amazing. That Sarah Zawa in there. But, yeah, this thing is... Wow. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's my unboxing. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, like I said, this is my first time, so sorry it wasn't, you know, you know probably the best, but uh, I really, really wanted to do an un unboxing uh, for my first time, especially for these guys. Um, these guys were, like I said, these were gems that I found, and, you know, basically I just kind of held them all for uh, on Yahoo Japan. I thought about keeping them in, you know, the warehouse and stuff like that, but I wanted to get these in hand so badly that I just sucked it up and paid, you know, ridiculous amount of shipping for DHL, which I will not be doing ever again. So, sorry, Gigantic Mega Godzilla, but you will be sitting for a while until they ship you EMS. So, um, but other than that, uh, thanks everybody. Uh, hopefully, if you like it, uh, I'll make another one for other figures. Um, but yeah, um, thanks for watching.